Hey. Look at my Van Gogh mug. Makes me very happy. Also, I'd like you guys to meet Wayne. He's a frog. Because as he says in the song, I can be a frog. He can be a frog. Um, so <laughs> earlier this week, Colby and I went and we saw our favorite band, The Flaming Lips, live in concert. And I don't think I will ever be the same again after that. Um, this was like the craziest concert experience overall thing that I've ever experienced ever. I don't even know how to start this. Colby had messaging back and forth with one of the drummers for the band since probably about September now, since we've been planning to go to this concert because we both love both of the drummers we decided that we were going to wear green wigs like the drummers do during lunch one day at school we decided to take a trip to party city to buy some green wigs and then we went to chick-fil-a to see how the drive through people at chick-fil-a would react um and here's some footage of that happening. Uh, we're getting wigs. Wigs are very important. What? We're not gonna run over people. Don't you love the protein? Oh! <laughs> I changed my mind. Um. Is it correlated to the rest of the piece? <laughs> oh, they just made an open shot. Goodbye, Naked Man. Naked Man returns to our lane. Um, no updates on the Naked Man car. Unfortunately, we do not know its whereabouts, um, and we did not end up catching up to it to get a better picture. Yeah. Like, this is strictly for Halloween. <laughs> <sighs> We got the goods. We got the goods. And Colby's being extra. You are not getting a cowbell. Exactly. You are not taking a cowbell no. to a concert. That'd be so inconsiderate. <laughs> See, that'd be like unbelievably like mean. <laughs> okay. Colby, give the fit check. Mm -hmm. So we got the blue. We are the putting these on in the car. We're putting them on the We car. are walking to school okay. like this. And I got the, we're not walking to school like this. Yeah, we are. No, we're not. I am. No, we're not. <laughs> we got him. We're at the Statue of Litterby. The Statue of Litterby. Oh, it's, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> the question is, how? Have you never won oh you've probably never worn a wig before. No. POV theater kid. I see, I see. You see, you see? <laughs> Why is it like so small on my head? <laughs> Come on, you look so pretty. It's got hair in my face. This just feels like when I had blue hair. It's just feeling like flashbacks. And I hate it already. I want a refund. You'll find a way. I'll let you down. Ooh. <laughs> Stop. You cannot do that, Ryan. You cannot do that, Ryan. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, Swamp Man is real. Oh, sheesh. It looks so freaking bad. How do I fix that? <laughs> Can you fix it for me? Like, like shove the top down a little bit. That's a bit you're, you're not doing it. You can't even tell it's a wig, pretty much. Frick! Oh my gosh! 
Look at that. Okay, why are we gonna be the main characters at this con? Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. Yeah. I like this. We're ready. Oh, <laughs> we're ready. Is Chick fil A ready for us? Is the question. <laughs> you know, when, me at Nick Lay right now. He doesn't know I know. Watch this. What? He doesn't know I know. Watch this. Watch this. I wonder if Ben Goins is subscribed to me. Important update, guys. He subscribed while I was editing. Hey, Chris. I challenge you to a rap battle on the next episode. I don't know. I don't think he knows that I have a YouTube channel. He doesn't, he, doesn't he doesn't know I know. Watch this. <laughs> Watch this video. Oh my gosh, the people looking at us in their cars. Are they, they don't know who we are. <laughs> they don't know we know. Watch, Watch this. this. I, bet th I bet this isn't my story. I'll do eight piece uh, nuggets and medium fries. Okay. As a meal? Yep. Okay, what's the drink? Uh, lemonade. What's up? Lemonade. Lemonade? Anybody else? <laughs> That'll be all. Y'all good? Yep. Yeah. It's for a concert. <laughs> it's for a concert? Yeah. Y'all performing? No, no. no. That, have you ever heard of the band The Flaming Lips by chance? The, the what now? The Flaming Lips? No. Their drummers have green wigs and headbands. Okay. Which so, so they reaction. don't like themselves. <laughs> Can I see some drummings? Can I see some drums? That's so I mean, sad. No, if they're... Give us drum, like do drum, drum? bro. Oh, okay. Just air drum. Bang your head, bro. Give us some. Yeah, witch. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm assuming you want Chick Fil A sauce. Finally, never mind. Um, what's the name again? <laughs> uh, Colby. No, no, no. The, oh, yeah. the flaming, flaming lips. lips. Flaming lips. And are you guys paying cash or card? Thank you. Oh my gosh. Love how he he probably put our name down as flaming lips. He definitely did. He definitely did. I always want to sing. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I feel about bad us. for this guy for talking about us. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I'm not too sure what he put it down as. Yeah. Yeah. Hit it through two of the three. <laughs> <laughs> We've got one more. <laughs> it says flaming red. <laughs> You've got to get a picture. Of We're Chick fil A celebrities now. We can't go to Chick Fil A ever they kept again. About no, no. Us. Every time I hear the ending of your shamey part, I'm like, wow. First guy looked like Fez from Euphoria. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning. It's concert day. So I woke up later than I intended today. Um, obviously, this is not what I'm wearing to the concert because I like to. Um, be dramatic but like this shirt is no offense not something i'd wear to school i'm gonna put on the wig and my shirt later but i have my yoshimi necklace which i made it's the american dream and the american hardcore there should be unicorns ones with the purple eyes not the green eyes. It's concert day. The time, of course. And it came time to go to the concert. Um, we ended up hearing them doing sound check, and it was insane. They're back there. Mm -hmm. There they are. I just heard. Wee, wee. <laughs> they might. I bet they are. That's how. Big sound check right now. We're at the restaurant. Wee, wee. We can line up in an hour, which is an hour before the show. So we're camping at the front of the line. <laughs> Front center. Front center. Front center. <laughs> so we get to the venue and um, we got there about an hour-ish before 
they officially would let people in. We were the first two people there, decided we made a few new friends, a couple of which ended up being next to us during the actual show. They were incredible. Uh, they had a couple of technical difficulties before they were able to let us in, so we ended up waiting outside all in all for a total of three hours. <laughs> There was a point in time when we were waiting in that super long line um there was this really awesome like so cool security guard he got coming out um and we loved him and at one point somebody made a joke that because it was taking so long he should bring us all beer and he did <laughs> Obviously, Colby and I did not get beer because we are 16, but they also offered water, but I had to pee so bad. Like, I, words cannot stress enough how afraid I was of, like, peeing my pants during the concert. We'd gone to the restaurant beforehand, and I'd had, like, this much of my drink, but the cups were this big. And like this big around, it, it was crazy. And Kobe drank the whole thing and didn't have to pee once. Uh? Anyway, um, so I thought I was gonna um, just die. Kobe and I were so determined to get front row though, because we'd been planning that since September. We were like, we got general admission, but we're gonna get there early. And we're gonna get in the front. And so he was saying, well, you know, if you need to go to the bathroom, you can go to the bathroom as soon as we get in and I can secure our spot. What if I go to the bathroom and I get lost? They ended up opening up one of the side gates during the line. So I just went to the bathroom during the line and I came back. So it ended up being fine. I did not pee my pants. Let the record show. No pants were peed during the Fleming Lips concert, but I thought they were going to be. I, I thought I was going to have an act. But, but we, we did get into the venue first. Like, before anybody else, um, we scanned our tickets, and here's us running into the venue, only to realize that we are literally the first people there. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Hey! Oh my oh. gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> um, while the opening group, um, the Heartless Bastards, perform- oh, first of all, first of all- <laughs> I can't move on without saying that they were incredible. Um, while they performed, I saved our spots and then Colby went to the merch booth to see if he could get one of the signed posters. He got to meet the drummers and got to get pictures with them and that was crazy. And this is us waiting for the lips to get on stage. <laughs> Where's your shirt? What? Where's your shirt? Then, suddenly, they were there. Um, and the drummers got on stage, and they were they were taking pictures of Colby and I. Here's the picture that Nick got, and I. It's so crazy. So then the concert started. <laughs> And I was absolutely living on cloud nine. The lead singer, uh, Wayne Coyne, ended up pointing Colby and I out at one point and saying he loved us and like gesturing to us and like singing with us because we were just having an absolute blast. <laughs> like just so crazy after the show i bought some stuff let me show you like, okay got the poster <laughs> it is almost as big as i am very tall also i'm sh very short but it is very cool this was our show it has everybody else at the bottom anyway um kobe and i bought the same things we both bought that poster we also both bought the tour shirt 
Which, by the way, I <laughs> I put this shirt on to film this part, but I, other than that, have not really <laughs> taken this shirt off since I bought it. I've just been showering and then washing the shirt and then putting it back on. Look at it! It's so freaking cool! This is the American Head album cover and then the back has all the toys. Colby ended up stealing the C balloon from the Fuck Yeah Cincinnati sign, so that was very hype. Overall, like, I don't- I don't even have words to describe how cool of a show that was. Rarely do you see a band or a concert where you feel like you're a part of it, where you feel like everybody in the room is all contributing to something. When we got home, um, the <laughs> lead singer Wayne Coyne ended up following me on Instagram and um, I think I died a little bit. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I, as always, make absolutely no promises on when my next video will be, but it will be sometime within the next five years. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, be sure to like, subscribe, comment, all the things. Um, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!